A family displaced after a man and a woman were shot at their North Omaha home this morning. Reporter Joe Kadat spoke with the 18-year-old daughter of the woman who was shot and killed at 39th in Kansas. Joe? 35-year-old Suzanne Pope and 44-year-old Curtis Goodwin were shot at their home at about 4.30 this morning at 39th in Kansas. Pope was pronounced dead on scene. Goodwin remains in critical condition at the hospital after undergoing surgery today. 18-year-old Nicole Pope found out this morning that her and her 7-year-old sister no longer have a mom. Somebody took her life away and I can't just call my mom when I want to. I'm just upset that they took my mom away from my 7-year-old sister and she saw what my mom looked like after the fact. Pope says she has these words for whoever killed her mom. For the people who did it, I just want them to know that they took a mom from an 18-year-old and they took a mom from a 7-year-old. That 7-year-old has to grow up without her mom and I know how hard it is when you need your mom all the time and she doesn't have that now. 44-year-old Curtis Goodwin remains in critical condition with gunshot wounds. Nicole Pope's boyfriend, Michael Fontelroy, says Goodwin is his mentor. He basically replaced as a father figure in my life and he taught me everything I know with cars and as a career and it's just hard it's just hard right now to realize that this stuff happened. We also caught up with two neighbors who say they heard and partially saw what happened at about 4:30 this morning on Kansas Avenue who both say they heard two gunshots. William Colglazer says he saw a male run from the victim's home after the shooting. It was just unreal. I couldn't believe it was happening. I mean, these people down the street, you know, they they've never raised a ruckus, you know, I'm, I don't know them personally, but, you know, they, they just seem like quiet, normal people. Neighbor Jacob Gilbert says there were several kids inside his home when he heard gunshots and saw a black newer model Chevy Suburban speed away from the crime scene. Get all the doors locked, make sure none of the kids stand up, stay down towards the floor, because if anything's going to go through here, it ain't going to go through the floor. Nicole Pope says her mom doesn't have life or medical insurance. A GoFundMe page is set up, and we have a link to that at KMTV.com. Reporting live, Joe Kadat, KMTV Action 3 News.